So we are in on live. We are uh, is uh, is working on. Just let me know. Huh? We are live. Okay. We are uh, is uh, is working on. Just let me know. Huh? Yeah. We are live. Okay. We are uh, is uh, is working on. So uh, just um, before I go on to speaking, um, I think all the panelists here need to be mute, uh, so the sound will be clearer. And I see, okay, thank you. So just wanted to say, I am so thrilled, uh, happy to, to be here today um, on this screen, my computer screen, seeing so many people from so many countries ready to collaborate together and uh, work together to help so many people. And uh, I must say, I, with a lot of enthusiasm yesterday night, went to sleep, had a wonderful dream. Basically, my dream was that uh, there, there was a lot of, like a big well of water. There were people kind of jumping in there and and then some people seems like dying there, and I have to bring two bodies out, and then, and then from there, both of them first looks like a dead. Then, just uh, I pressed on their heart, and the water came out from the mouth, and another one blow in the head, and the life came back. It's it just like uh, made me kind of felt like this is a, a maybe a very interesting uh, and very important uh, healing uh, kind of. Uh, uh, networks like we are trying to kind of help many people through healing. So I just want, I'm so excited about it. Just wanted to say that, and uh, I wanted to thank uh, uh, Facebook uh, TWR Facebook Live team, who has been working so hard for many days until to last minute here as we were struggling. We did not know for sure we we're going to be able to do this or not until to the last minute. So I wanted to thank the Facebook Live team and also all the practice leaders from uh, all different countries. Uh, here we have uh, 16, right? We have, I think, 16 uh, people. So I will slowly introduce. So before I go into that, I want, just wanted to say a few remarks about the practices. Um, first of all, I think uh, the practices, what we are doing, uh, this is, it's, it's a kind of form of a healing practice, very important healing practice, but it's also a form of our own spiritual practice. I look this as a, my own uh, spiritual practice, my own practice of Dharma. And the meaning of Dharma is really like a um, liberation from suffering, liberation from pain and its causes. So liberation of, from suffering, pain and its causes is the, this, the most important uh, purpose or the most important purpose of the teaching of the Dharma. And I think this is exactly what we are doing here in a very kind of mundane way, in a very uh, every day-to-day -day way, we are kind of helping everybody to able to kind of deal with their own whatever level of pain, uh, physical, emotional, spiritual, whatever level of pain they are manifesting. So it's very much uh, able to work with that. Um, so during these next 10 days, I think I would uh, strongly uh, recommend to everybody that this as a, all the practice leaders and all the practice uh, uh, Sangha members uh, that this is it's very important that we all uh, connect, uh, we all commit. So the commitment and the connection is I think is one of the most important thing because we during this 10 day, we don't want to take it very light because we all have put so much energy into it. So we want everybody to fully committed to the next 10 days to practices, doing the practices, following the advices for your own sake or for your own well-being. 
I wanted to really like emphasize that the commitment is very important. This commitment is not toward anybody. This commitment is toward yourself. And uh, also that uh, there are so many people around the world that we are seeking for the same thing and for seeking for same support. And we are also kind of sending this energy of support. I am definitely uh, sending my prayers, my energy to support every single one of you. And these practice leaders, they are doing the same thing. So I expect the same, everybody who is participating in this next 10 days uh, practice, that you feel that you have, uh, you have this great support. And unless you are open to see that, uh, and uh, feel that and connect with that, you're not going to get one. So it's very important that you know there is a support. You wanted to look for it. You wanted to feel it. You wanted to connect with it. And then you wanted to benefit from it. So the commitment and connection, it's a very, very important part of here. So the last thing uh, is the um, I wanted to introduce the each uh, practice leaders from different countries. So I will uh let uh, each one of you introduce for like a minute or something like that just uh tell uh, everybody uh, your name uh, your country and just uh, whatever few words you wanted to share please welcome so i will start with the uh, czech republic uh joseph so you wanted to unmute and then uh, and i will then uh, mute again after you speak, please. Hello, Rinpoche. Do you hear me? Oh, tak moje jméno je Josef a budu vést praxi v českém jazyce. Děkuji všem. Okay, Danish, uh, it's a uh, Brita here. Okay, so then uh, the English Marcy and Rob. Hello, everyone. Thank you, Rubache. I'm um, hmm. Marcy, and I'm going to be guiding in English. And I, I feel it's a great honor. And uh, thank you all for participating in this. And hello, everyone. My name is Rob Patsik. I'm in the United States, and I'll be alternating the practice sessions with Marcy over the next nine days for after today. Thank you. It's wonderful to be here. So, yeah, just I think uh, you wanted to mention the country where you and your name, and then, uh, yeah, so speak maybe a little bit uh, stronger voice so we can hear well. So, Fish. Ja hei kaikille, mun nimi on Olli, olen Helsingissä ja hoidan nämä Ligminsan lähetykset nyt joka päivä seuraavan kymmenen päivän ajan kello yhdeksän. Ja kiitoksia Rinpotselle, että saan olla tässä mukana. Thank you. We are definitely enjoying this different sound, right? Everybody's enjoying it. <laughs> okay, wonderful. And French, please. Bonjour à tous, je suis Pierre et je guiderai les pratiques en français depuis Paris avec Guy qui est l'autre moitié de l'équipe. Ok, so Guy is not there. Oui, oui. Ok, can you speak please, uh, speak... Uh... Hello Rinpoche. Mm. Donc je m'appelle Guy. Je suis de Suisse et je vais guider en français la deuxième partie des méditations avec Pierre. Thank you. In German, please. In... Hallo, hallo Rinpoche. Einen schönen guten Abend aus Wien, aus Österreich. Ich bin Heide und ich werde die Meditationen ab morgen auf Deutsch uh, anleiten und ich freue mich schon sehr darauf. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hungarian. 
Üdvözlök mindenkit, Olivia vagyok, és Norbertel együtt fogunk gyakorlatot vezetni a következő tíz napba felváltva, fél kilenckor, holnaptól kezdve. Várunk mindenkit szeretette. Köszönöm. Good evening, Green Pocsán. Várom én is ezt a tíz napot, hogy Olivia-val együtt vezessük a gyakorlatokat, és... Várunk mindenkit szeretettel, és reméljük, hogy minden rendben lesz, úgyhogy gyertek gyakorolni. Este fél kilenctől várunk akkor benneteket. Szerúztok! Italian. Buonasera. Buonasera, rinpoche. E ciao a tutti. Sono Lia che eh, trasmetto dall'Italia, guiderò la pratica dall'Italia e devo dire che è veramente emozionante essere qui con tutti questa sera. Grazie. Grazie. Uh, Corian, uh, you unmute, uh, uh, Teresa, unmute. Uh, Teresa, you need to unmute. Uh, the mic. There is a oh. button. Okay, good. Rinpoche, can you hear me? Yes, no? please. Hi, everybody. Hi, Rinpoche. Chairman Hong Kiang Imida, Hangong Malo, ten day meditation, Hangok Sandi Reggae Kaida, I guess, Mida, Erevan Pangas Mida. Polish. Uh, hi Rinpoche, hi everybody, mm, mam na imię Jarek i będę prowadził praktyki języku polskim, także serdecznie zapraszam wszystkich, tak jak powiedział Rinpoche, taki mały retreat, praktyki będą zawsze o godzinie 19, każdego dnia przez 108 dni i można je oglądać na profilu Ligmincza Polska. Dzięki i do usłyszenia. Dzięki, thank you. Uh, Portuguese? Bom dia a todos, eu sou a Alessandra, eu e a Jeane vamos estar fazendo a tradução e as práticas aqui de São Paulo, Brasil, em português. Uh, Russian? Uh, unmute uh, the mic, please, and speak a little louder. A little louder. Okay, sorry. Uh, good evening, Rinpoche. Good evening, everybody. Я живу в России, в Санкт-Петербурге, и очень рад участвовать в этом замечательном мероприятии. Соответственно, буду переводить на русский язык и вести медитацию по-русски. Спасибо. Slovak, please. Meditácii po slovensky. A každý večer o pol o deviatej budem na vás všetkých tešiť tými veľkosťou, že Marín počul devine toto úlohu. Teším sa na vás. Thank you. Spanish. Hola Rinpoche, hola a todos. Es un gusto muy grande, un honor muy grande eh, estar aquí, participar en este proyecto de los 10 días y con mucho gusto voy a guiar meditación en español desde México, desde el sitio Ligmincha en español en Facebook. Muchas gracias. Tashi de la Rinpoche. Uh, mi nombre es Santiago, junto con Lourdes estaré guiando las prácticas de meditación. Estaremos guiando dos veces al día para las personas en toda eh, Latinoamérica y en Europa. Los esperamos. Turkish. Taşidelik, iyi akşamlar. İlker Hocam ve ben Zeyno, önümüzdeki 10 gün rehberli meditasyon çalışmalarını Türkçe olarak 
birlikte gerçekleştireceğiz. Çok teşekkürler. Thank you. Thank you, Rinpoche. Thank you, Rinpoche. Hello, everybody. Okay. So, wow, that worked. <laughs> So amazing, uh, we, we did not know it's going to work, but uh, it's just work. We were, everybody's in, in the last moment, it will it work, will it not work, but it worked wonderful, it's so exciting. Um, so thank you very much, everybody being here. And uh, it's just so nice to hear different languages, different voices, and also I can see some uh, enthusiastic and a smiling face in everybody. <laughs> um, so I think uh, the next thing is to, uh, we will guide through the practices. So um, yeah, right. And maybe Lourdes, please uh, um, let me know anything I'm not doing the right. So I'll just, <laughs> just go. Yes, yes Rinpoche, now we are about to leave. And you will continue here, but, okay. uh, but uh, especially the translators, we need to leave to our translation booths. Sure. So basically, I will, I will send all of you these guide, uh, guidelines or practices that I have in, in, in text. And I hope best wishes to all of you. Thank you. So now you can. Thank leave. you. Thank you. So I will guide through this practice. So please sit comfortably. Um, those you know the five-point posture, uh, sit in the five-point posture. And those you don't know and have some physical conditions does not allow that, sit comfortably. Keep your spine straight, chest open, chin slightly down. Nine breathing or purification. Imagine and feel the presence of three channels in your body. White channel on the right, red channel on the left, the blue channel in the center. Side channels are connected to the two nostrils. The central channels move up through the center of your body, opens in the crown. The junction of these three channels at the, below the navel, about four inches, these three channels are connected, a shape of letter W. Just for a moment, feel the presence of the three channels in your body. Press your ring finger. Press your right nostril. Breathe in from left, deep. The air moves up from the left, moves up from the right. Then press left nostril, breathe out from the right three times. Imagine and feel all the anger related emotion, pain, conflict, blockages. Clear that, 
three times. Now press your left ring finger, left nostril, breathe in from the right, goes down, and press right nostril, breathe out from the left nostril three times, and imagine all the attachment-related emotions, blockages, sickness, pain, conflict, just feel all, you rele release that out, Now breathe in from both nostrils. Breath goes through the side channels, go all the way down and down, arrive at the junction. As it's entered through the central channel upward, then breathe out. When, as you breathe out, the energy moves up through the central channel, clears the central channel. And as you, when you do that, imagine and feel all the ignorance related emotion, pain, blockages, you clear that central channel, central of your body, the core part of your body. Just f imagine and feel clearing. Repeat this three times. Just imagine and feel the shift in your body, shift in these channels. They are more open, more clearer. And as you breathe continuously, and con breathe continuously deep, like almost like twice, each exhalation release out all the tension that you are feeling this moment. Clear all the tensions that you are feeling this moment as you breathe out. Just continue few deep breathing and each exhalation rest deeper, connect deeper with your body, connect deeper with that stillness, 
connect deeper with that silence. Connect deeper with that inner space, sacred space. Continue the breath from the core, breathing from the core, clearing, resting deeper. As you breathe deep, pay very close attention to exhalation and release every tension that you're conscious, you're aware in your body, in your breath, in your mind, this very moment. Rest deeper into the stillness of your body. Be aware and connect with that. Just try at least three to five deep breath. Breathe out, rest and connect with the stillness of the body. Through the stillness of your body, be aware of inner stillness, deep stillness where there is no conflict, where there is no pain. There is only pure, sacred space. Breathe deep continuously, pay close attention to the exhalation and release out any voices of pain, pain speeches, doubt. Just clear them out, breathe them out, trust the power of the breath. And each deep exhalation rest deeper into that silence. Feel the silence. Be aware of that silence. Listen to the silence. Connect with that silence. Use the breath.
feel and be aware of inner silence. Feel the sense of trust to the inner silence. Be aware of that inner silence. The awareness of inner silence is the wisdom of silence. Feel the presence of that wisdom deep in you. Breathe deep continuously, much longer breath than usually you breathe. I often say sometimes twice longer, if at least much longer. Use the exhalation to breathe out all the negative thoughts, doubts, fears. The breath can clear thoughts. The awareness of the breath can clear. It's like a wisdom wind clearing the clouds of thought, giving access to that boundless sacred space of the sky. Feel that inner sky, inner sacred space as you clear thoughts through the breath. Breathe deep continuously. Just be aware the inner stillness, the inner silence, the inner spaciousness, these inner three dimensions are not separate from each other. Stillness is silence. Silence is that sacred space. Sacred space is that stillness. They're all one. You're resting deep in your true being, true self. From this source, from this inner sacred space, from this true place, place of being, gradually bring into a conscious, be aware of your pain. Whatever most disturbing pain for you particularly this moment in your life, either it's a sickness and physical pain, or you're going through the challenges of emotions, so it's emotional pain. Just bring into a conscious. Means simply be aware of it. not conceptualizing about your pain, 
not identifying with your pain, simply being aware as it is, as you're experiencing. Not ignoring your pain, not judging your pain or pain self. Be fully present with it. Be fully aware of it. And the power of awareness, it will clear gradually like light will clear the darkness. Bring your full attention to that location in your body, just being presence. Presence of boundless space, presence of pure awareness, presence of genuine warmth in that location, no elaboration of any kind of conceptual mind. Being presence of space, awareness and warmth. you will witness that it's clearing slowly the power of that awareness. Be aware that it's clearing, but you don't change anything. Remain presence with these three qualities. Continue. If you're not paying fully attention what I'm saying, my guiding practice, be aware of that, that you are not fully paying attention. As you know that, it will help you to bring your attention back to practice. The power of being will help heal. The power of present will help heal. The power of awareness as a light, the light will help heal the darkness of pain. Remain present. Naturally allow, as pain is decreasing, blockages clearing, opening up more space, from that space, from that new space, clear space, fresh sense of being, the qualities will merge, a sense of warmth. Allow the warmth. Allow 
a sense of care, as kindness, compassion toward yourself, toward that pain self, toward that pain in your body or pain of emotion. Bring that kindness, care, warmth, compassion toward yourself. But coming from that sacred space, coming from that pure awareness, coming from that from that genuine warmth, not coming from another pain. Like a loving mother, very open, very kind, very relaxed mother, seeing the need of the child, seeing and feeling the pain of the child, and bringing this full, loving, kind attention and holding the baby, holding the child. Your awareness is that mother. Your ignorance and the pain which produced by ignorance is like that child, unmature. Just feel this loving kindness, care, compassion. Arising from that sacred space and awareness toward yourself and toward your pain and allow the healing to occur. Continue. and feel the support that we are all supporting each other. Unless you are aware, there is a support for you. You trust that, you look for that, you connect with that, then only you will benefit from it. We are all supporting each other. The cyber Sangha is supporting each other. I dedicate these practices to all the sentient beings this moment who are suffering, who are in pain, who are in the process of healing. May these practices help them all heal their pain, sufferings, find their way to ultimate liberation.
Thank you. Thank you all. You can open your eye. As I uh, mentioned earlier, so I would like everybody to commit for next 10 days uh, in these practices that this is uh, a teacher coming to your home in your life, your place, not requiring anything to help you. The Sangha is coming to your place in your life, to not requiring anything to, but help you, to help you through, go through uh, better what you are going through. To, so uh, understand, so uh, have some commitment and feel connection and support here. And uh, I would uh, ask everybody to, you know, please give me feedback about how it's going on. Because uh, since uh, um, now, now each, so we have like 16 uh, different uh, languages uh, that uh, basically supporting all of you. So uh, it's kind of difficult to keep the communication with everyone with everybody to know what's going on. So I would recommend that uh, in, in your own country, in your own language, how the practice is going, um, uh, how it can, how it's benefiting you, the process, what's going on. If you give some feedback in my Facebook, Tenzin um, Facebook, uh, I'm, I'm going to read all those comments uh, in, on my Facebook so I know more or less how things are going and if anything and I, I really look forward to that so it kind of this is what inspires me also and uh, uh, I wanted to thank everybody once again thank you so much so I wish you all the very best <laughs>